Trump classified documents case has been dismissed. The judge finds special counsel appointment is unconstitutional. The U.S. District Court Judge Eileen Cannon dismissed Donald Trump's classified documents case, ruling that the appointment of special counsel Jack Smith was unconstitutional. Kyle Cheney on, uh, posted on X, breaking Judge Cannon has dismissed the Trump documents case citing violation of appointments clause. The special counsel's position effectively usurps that important legislative authority transferring it to a head of department and the process threatening the structural liberty inherent to the separation of powers, Cannon wrote in her decision. He can be appointed and confirmed through the default method prescribed in the appointment clause as Congress has directed for United States attorneys throughout American history. Dismissal of this action is the only appropriate solution for the appointments clause violation. The ruling comes after Judge Cannon had indefinitely postponed the trial and followed a May hearing in which Trump and co-defendant Walt Nauta argued that the Justice Department Special Counsel's Office decision to prosecute the valet was both successive, selective and vindictive. In a statement on Truth Social, Trump wrote, as we move forward in uniting our nation after the horrific events on Saturday, the dismissal of the lawless indictment in Florida should be just the first step following quick, followed quickly by the dismissal of all the witch hunts added the Democrat Justice Department coordinated all of these uh, political attacks, which are an election interference conspiracy against Joe Biden political opponent, me, he said. Let's come together and end all weaponization of our justice system and make America great again, was Trump's statement. The ruling marks the, another blockbuster legal victory for Trump following the Supreme Court's July 1st ruling that the former president has immunity from prosecution for any of his actions in office. And according to Reuters, prosecutors are likely to appeal the ruling as courts in other cases have repeatedly upheld the ability of the DOJ to appoint special counsels for politically sensitive investigations. But Cannon's ruling throws the future of the case which once posed serious legal peril for Trump into doubt Smith is also prosecuting Trump in federal court in Washington over his attempt to overturn the 2020 election, but his lawyers have not made a similar challenge to the special counsel in that case. In the documents case, Trump was indicted on charges that he willfully retained sensitive national documents, security documents at his Mar-a-Lago social club after leaving office and obstructed government efforts to retrieve the material. The Trump's, uh, Trump's attorneys challenged the legal authority of Biden AG Merrick Garland 2022 decision to appoint Smith, arguing that the appointment violated the Constitution because his office was not created by Congress, nor was Smith confirmed by the Senate. Meantime, Supreme Court Justice Clarence Thomas also boosted Trump's challenge, directly questioning the constitutionality of Smith's appointment Thomas used to uh, similar arguments by those made by Trump's legal team. And this is on Zero Edge by Tyler Durden. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. I really support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.